Welcome to another edition of Off Grid Contracting. I'm Lucas Cameron. I want to show you guys um, a project that we've done for a customer I am really excited about. Is This is something unique that as far as water feed into your home, a lot of people uh, want a pumping solution uh, for that. And they also want to gravity feed it when they possibly can. And in this scenario, we got both. Um, right now we've connected these ibcs we've got the option where you can use part of your system and not deplete it all at one time um, right here it's exposed at the moment so you can see this is coming out into packs um, and then obviously foam wrapped uh, for protection there uh, moving on around uh, we're always conscious about saving customers money this um, if you've seen in the past on my YouTube channel here at Seven Trumpets Prepper. Um, you've seen where that I've done a build, and you can also check the iCard right there, um, how to repurpose a satellite mount. This is actually a really heavy duty satellite mount um, that the customer had laying around. So we actually repurposed the arms off of it that were in the bracket. And then we repurposed the bracket mount and the equatorial mount itself. And so we've got that now mounted to hold his solar panel. This is actually uh, Carmana solar panel 160 watt. Uh, it's the first time I've ever had opportunity to work with this particular solar module. It has really nice output on it. Um, the, uh, the panel ended up really nice on the mount on the ground there. It's tucked out of the way. Uh, now we we did tuck the wires. I'm actually going to take the camera at the moment here and take in show you the pumping system, which I'm very excited about. Now, we just helped the customer change their filters because what happened is, as you can see, that is not dirt in those filters uh, holders. That is actually where that the whale um, had gotten uh, debris, was pumping debris. So what happened is we replaced the water feed into their house from the whale into the filtration system now uh, from the pump unit. Now, this is a flow jet. We also have a pre-filter in place. So there's actually three filters in this unit now. And um, to, uh, there's a little bit of water flow at the moment. It's pressurized right now. Um, the door's gonna go back and then everything can be covered um, and loomed at that point right there. There's the water flowing. It's pretty quiet. Um, doesn't make a lot of noise. Now this torch controller unit is from um, Hurricane Wind Power. This is some of their new uh, charge controlling units. They've got a lot of new units on the market. Um, MPPT um, for small solar applications. And um, here's the customer's battery. And we've got the feeds coming off of that. We've got it fused and everything. And all this solar is dedicated for is just um, just for the pump. So the, the pump only uses about uh, 12 amps. And we're putting um, roughly about 13 into the battery bank. So always making more than it's ever going to use. We're 100% matched on the ratio uh, right now. And um, and of course, the pump's only on uh, whenever needed because it's constant pressure on the diaphragm. It's also variable speed um, and can move uh, five gallon per minute. So uh, really nice. Just one more look right there. That's the uh, solar. Really turned out nice. So guys, if you want something like this done, make sure to check us out at offgridcontracting.com. We'll go anywhere in the world. We'll make it happen for you. And as always, until we see you again here at Seven Trumpets Prepper Channel, I hope you have a most blessed day in Yahushua name.